Good evening, students. This is Mamun here. Today, we are going to start elementary English language course, the unit number three, time of class eight. So far, we have covered, uh, we have studied this, um, right, Mahmoud? We have studied this, and also we have done this. Okay, so we're going to start from here today. Practice. Let me zoom. Can you hear, see this one? Pa see this page, Mohammed Ali? Yeah, yeah. Be beautiful. So we're going to start from here of the unit three. We have done uh, previous pages <laughs> other day. Now, mm -hmm. uh, talking about you, match the questions and answers. Use the words in the box to complete the questions. Then listen and check. So we're going to listen our audio and after the audio, We'll complete uh, this uh, matching question and answer with this box word. Okay, so listen carefully this audio, please. 3.5 Talking about you. 1. What time do you get up? At about 7 o'clock. 2. Who do you live with? My parents and my sister. 3. How do you travel to school? I always walk. 4. Do you go out on Fridays? Yes, I do sometimes. 5. What do you do on Sundays? I don't do much. I like to relax. 6. Where do you go on holiday? We often go to Spain. 7. Why do you like to go there? Because it's always sunny. 8. When do you go to bed? Usually late, about midnight. All right. <clears throat> now uh, we are going to complete this one. Like we can see the first one is done. What time do you get up? at about seven o'clock. Second one, do you live with this? What will be the, from here? And I'm matching. First of all, what where, will be? where, Same. where do you? Do you live with, do you live yeah. with? So yeah. Here, do you live where, with? Yeah, in, where do you live with? Where do you, does it go? Where do you live with? It's saying uh, living okay. with somebody, you know. So yeah, living with somebody with with. So if it is living with somebody, it is okay. asking literally, you know, about that somebody or about that person. Uh, who 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 do you live with? That's right. So it's who do you live with? Okay, beautiful. Now yeah. at the same time, okay, let's finish the answering. Then we'll match. Mm -hmm. Next one. Do you travel to school? Do you travel to school? So, you know, do you travel to school? It's asking, yeah, when, you know, hmm? Yeah, when do you travel to school? When do you travel to school? You know, travel to school when, meaning like it's asking, um, you know, we travel to school and, you know, the means of, transportation that we take to travel so actually yeah. you know what means of transportation we take to travel to uh, school it can be like bus it can be school bus can be private car can be by work you know anything um, can okay. you guess okay then what what do you travel to school what 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 again it's 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 making you um, you know, in a situation where you have to say that uh, the means or way you travel to. So it's asking, you know, see the meaning of this. What, where, when, who, how, do, why. See, so it's, it will be wha yeah. how, how, you know, how, 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 yeah. how, how, yeah, my how do you travel? How do you travel to school, right? So, how yeah. do you travel to school? 
what doesn't go what means you know meaning some stuff you know what do you travel to like it doesn't make sense either okay is that clear so this is wh yes. word we have learned this before but anyway by this practice we'll get to know like who do you live with to ask about something or someone we can use who yeah say yeah. about how we travel we use how okay uh, and we we yes, use the yes, uh, wh word just before the auxiliary verb okay to make the question like the way you can see do is auxiliary verb who do you live yeah. with how is auxiliary yeah. verb do is auxiliary verb yeah. how do you travel to school okay let's go to the next one you go uh, out on friday you go out on friday fridays yeah. what will be, what will be here Check these boxes, check these boxes and try to yeah. make a meaningful word. I don't want to say right yeah. away. Take your time. Yeah. Number four, you go out on Fridays. What will be the okay. answer here? Okay. Yeah. Why do you go out on Friday? Why? Why you go out on Fridays? Well, it kind of it can be why you go out on Fridays, but you know try to have more matched. And that's see that number five. Okay, we'll do that one later because it's it's become kind of right. So we'll, we'll go we'll go for that one next. Um, let's do the five okay. number. We'll come back to that. We'll come back to number four shortly. Let's do number five. That's do you do on Sundays? That's do you do on Sundays? Yeah. Uh, where do you do on Sunday? It's it's saying about something that we do, you know. Do you do yeah. on Sundays? Like something he does on Sundays, but we don't know what he does. So what we can ask, how we can know that information? Where? You no, know, the information or things that he does on Sundays. It is by the questioner, it is a question to the listener to point out or to know that what exactly he does on Sundays. So, you know, it will be what? What do you do what? on Sundays, right? Uh -huh. What do you do on Sundays? Good. Number six, yeah, do you go on holiday? Do you go on holiday? So uh -huh. we use what? We use what time? We use um, uh, we use mm -hmm. how? You know, we use who? So this one, that's do you go on holiday? Like, do you go on holiday? So it's asking Uncle. about. Yep. Can you try? Yeah. Do you go on Friday? Uh, yeah. Okay. Do you go on on holidays? Do you go on holiday? Where do you go on holiday? Yeah, it should be where. Where? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Uh, it it could be where, or even it could be. Okay. Let's say, do you like to go there? Do you go to bed? Okay. Um, it could be where, or it could be when. Let's see. Okay. Let's see. It's where. You are right. Where do you go on holiday? Where do you yeah. go on holiday? Okay, it's asking about the place where he goes yeah. for holiday. Good. Number seven. Do you like to go there? Do you like to go there? What will be there? Do you like to go there? When? When do you like to go there? When? Right. Um, next one. Do you go to bed? So this one, I think, because he's saying... Um, uh, why do you go on holiday? And he has made answer. We often go to Spain. And now next question, the listener, uh, question is asking, why do you go to, go, do you, why do you like to go there? You know, why? Remember, why? Why do you like yeah. to go there? Yeah. Next, yeah. do you go to bed? Like it's asking about, you know, time to go bed, you know, so it will be, you know, what we can say here. When no. When right. So when do you go to bed? See, all the yeah. wh yeah. word are used except the do. Now see the makes meaning. Do you go out on Friday? So mm -hmm. it is asking about if we go out on Friday or not. Okay. 
Good. Now, yeah, based okay. on this, we're going to match this uh, answer. Start. What time do you get up? You say at about seven o'clock. Number two, who do you live with? What will be the answer for this question? Who do you live with? Let's read. I'm coming. Okay, uh, who do you live with? Uh -huh. It should be my, my, e, my parents and my sister. That's right, my friend and my sister. Good, it will be the answer. We'll match this one later. Let's finish now. Now, number three, how do you travel to school? How do you travel to school? Okay, uh, number G, I always work. work. I always work. Okay, yeah. that's good. Number four, do you go out on Fridays? Do you go out on Fridays? Yeah, number A, yes, I do yes, sometimes. I do sometimes, good. Yeah. What do you do on Sundays? What do you do on Sundays? Okay, number H. I don't do much. I like I to like to relax. Relax. Good. Is Muhammad uh, there? Are you listening? Would you like to join in the class? I can see you are in, but you know, looking at you won't be able to learn that much. To learn something, you have to be participated, and also you have to participate in our interactive class that we're doing now. Would you like to join? Mohammed? Okay, that's fine. I think he's not listening to us. There, there might be a technical <coughs> problem. All right, next one. Uh, where do you go on holiday? Where do you go on holiday? Number six. Can you guess? Okay, number number D. We often go to Spain. Number D. We often go to Spain. Good. We often go to Spain. Number seven. Why? Why do you like to go there? Okay, number F, because it's always sunny. Because it's always sunny. Good. Now, yeah. last one. When do you go to bed? At about seven o'clock. Hmm? Number is, C. Number C belongs to one. Can you see? It's already merged. Okay. When uh, do you go to bed? That was what time do you get up? So at about seven, yeah. oh, we get up. Oh, number B, number B. Sorry, say number B. Usually late, Usually about late? my oh. night. Midnight. My yeah, midnight. Midnight. Yeah, midnight. Yeah, midnight. Late, midnight. About midnight. Good. Yeah, about midnight. About midnight. Okay, let's yeah. see. We can see the answer too. So as you can see, they are all matching. You have done a wonderful job. Right. Okay, because it's always sunny. Yes, I do sometimes, um, usually late about, all right, all of them are correct, beautiful. Now on number two, ask and answer the questions with partner, give true answer, then tell the class about you and your partner. Maria gets up at eight, I get up 7.30 on weekdays. All right, now I'm going to ask you these questions again to you. I want you to uh, answer with your true answer. I mean, with it fit in your life and say the true answer from yourself. Don't copy from here. Can you do that? Mohammed, can you do that? Uh, okay. 
let's give it a try. Yeah, say come again then. Okay. Please can, can, See number two, ask can, and answer can you the question. For me? Sure. C says ask and answer the questions with a partner. Give true answers. Then tell the class about your partner. Okay. Now I'm going to yeah. ask these questions to you again. And I don't okay. want you to copy from here. I want you to tell the true answer of your life. Okay. okay. Of your okay. life. And I okay. also um okay. Let's try. Okay. What time do you get up? And I want you to make a sentence, please. See, here they haven't made the sentence most of the times. So, um, okay, that's fine. You can say like that. Whatever you say, try something you answer, okay, rather than copying yeah. it. Imagine this part is not here, yeah. okay? Imagine this part is not here. Yeah. Okay, let's do. I... What time do you get up? Yeah. Sometime, I guess, at 4 a.m. 4 a.m. So you get up uh, 4 a.m. Some, uh, sometimes, okay, sometimes you get up 4 a.m. But what time do you get up usually? So you get up okay. at about 4 a.m. in the morning? It is usually 4.30 in the morning. Okay, good. Who do you live with? Uh, I live with my wife and my son. Good. How do you travel to school? Or how do you travel to your job, business? Okay. Uh, always I use my car. You use your car? Oh, I drive too? Yeah. I drive? Okay, good. Okay. Do you uh, go out on Fridays? Please come again. Do you go out on Fridays? Do you go yes. out on yes. Fridays? Yes, yes, I do. I, I'm going to prayers every Friday. Okay, so, so you, you, I go out on Friday for uh, yeah. Friday prayers. Okay, good. Uh, number five, what do you do on Sundays? Okay, on Sunday, I not do anything. I oh. relax. You relax, yep. Yeah. So I don't do anything or I don't do much. I relax. Okay, good. Yes. Now, mm, number six, where do you go on holiday? Or do you go to holiday? If you do, where do you go to holiday? You must have okay. gone to holiday. Yeah. Uh, holidays, I take uh, my son and my wife. So we're going to beach. So where do you go on holiday? Answer, like I go to holiday. Yeah. I I go on for holidays. Uh, we go to which where we go to sea beach. We go to any other country. Or we go to village. You know, we go to yeah. my neighbors. We go to my right. okay. House. okay 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 Good. okay okay. Now, why uh, do you like to go there? Because I go. Uh, because I'm going to visit my parents. Okay. Because I going to doesn't make sense. Okay. Either it will be I'm going to or I go okay. to. Okay. So here, okay. since since it is a general statement, it's not a continuous action. It is a just general statement. So it will be in present simple. So you can say, I go to see my parents. Okay. okay. Because yeah. I go to see my friends. Because I go there to see my friends. I go there to enjoy my leisure time. Okay. okay. To be present, okay. simple. Subject plus verb. Okay. Good. Okay. When do you go to bed? Uh, 
usually it's it's I'm going to usually eat okay. in the night. Okay, sure. Usually I go to bed eight o'clock at the night. Okay. Eight o'clock. Okay. Eight o'clock at the night or eight o'clock. So, okay. Yeah, is usually I going to bed. Hold on, I I going uh, to where did you get this? I, I yeah, go to I go I go to if you say something going ing from there must okay. have a auxiliary verb am I am going to. Okay, and that okay. I am going usually doesn't make you know that much sense because it is not a continuous yeah. action. It is an action that you usually do. Okay, then so it will be only the simple tense like I go to. Usually I go to bed at eight o'clock at the night. Okay, mm -hmm. something like this, please. Okay, good. So I want you to do some correction that you uh, you have a, a problem like you you say all the time I going to uh, so use wing or you use ing from a verb without the auxiliary so that doesn't make sense and that makes a uh, error in your sentence okay you have to rectify that one okay, okay. now next you have done a wonderful job anyway positive and negatives yeah. Make the sentence opposite. Now, good. I text my friends all the time. See, there is one example. I don't text my friends all the time. Likewise, all the sentences here, we have to make it opposite. Like, she doesn't speak Spanish. What will be the opposite sentence of this? She doesn't speak Spanish. She, she speak Spanish. Good. She speaks. With the speak, there will be yeah. ash, right? There yeah. will be ash yeah. because it is yeah. on third person uh, singular. Yeah. There, therefore, yeah. we have to add a s after the yeah. speak. So she speaks Spanish. Very good. Number three, yeah. they want to learn English. They, they don't want to learn English. Good. They don't want to learn English. So we use here a uh, negative uh, auxiliary verb, don't. Okay, good. They don't want to learn English. Next one. Oh, I'm tired and I want to go to bed. What will be the opposite? It, it should be, I'm not tired. I'm not tired. And? Yeah, and I'm going to go to, the, to bed. I what? I I repeat. I'm not. I am not tired. Yeah, I'm not tired. And yeah, I'm not tired. And and I want to go to bed. So you're not tired, and you want to go to bed. Is that make sense? That should be yeah. negative too, right? So uh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I'm not tired. <laughs> yeah, I'm not tired. I huh? don't want to go. I'm not tired. I don't want to go to bed. That's right. Good, good job. Number five, we don't eat in restaurants because we like cooking. We don't okay. eat in restaurants because we like cooking. What will be the opposite of this yeah. one? It's getting a bit challenging now. Let's try yeah. if you can. Because we like. So, no, I make calls, so let me, I'll try. Yep. Uh, we don't, we don't eat in a restaurant because we like cooking. Okay. Uh, it should be. It should be with it. Mm -hmm. We need eat We eat in restaurants, that's right. You're going right. Yes. Yeah. Because someone someone yeah, disturb me with call. Sorry for me. Okay. So we need we need eat in restaurants because we don't like 
looking. Good. So here, see the like. The verb after like, there must be ing form of another verb. Okay. After like, there will be ing form of verb. Like cooking. Okay. Good. Number six. Ima's, Ima isn't happy because she doesn't have a new car. What will be this one? Ima isn't happy because she doesn't have a new car. Can you try this one? Who can try? Is new Muhammad here? Can you try? Anyway, Ima isn't happy. Because she doesn't Say, have a new car. Yeah. Uh, Ima is adding happy because she doesn't have a new car. Mm. Okay. Okay, Ima is happy mm -hmm. because she has a new car. Good, but one little change. She has not have, okay? She yeah, okay. has, she has, he has, it has. We she, have, uh, yeah, she have, has. I have, okay? Yeah, yeah sorry, and she good. has a new no, that's car. That's fine, you're learning, all good. Um, Seven, I smoke, I drink, I don't go to bed early. Can you try this one? I smoke, I, I drink, I, smoke. I don't go to bed early. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I would. Uh, I can try. So, I not smoke. I not. I not. Where did you get? I not from. Not. Doesn't go. Only not. You have to use the auxiliary there. Try again. Okay. Tell me which sentence, which tense it is in. Which tense it is in? This is a present simple. Beautiful. It is in a present simple. And what we have auxiliary in present simple? Okay. Do or I does, am. right? Do does. Do yeah. for I, yeah. he, they, does for he, she, it. So here, to make negative, we have to use the do, and after that, not, like don't. We don't smoke. We don't smoke. Yeah. Okay? I, I don't. don't, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, yeah. They have used yeah. Paper. Yeah. I, yeah, I'm see. Sorry, for me. I don't smoke. Mm -hmm. I don't drink. Mm -hmm. And I don't go to. This one you have to make to, opposite too. So no, I don't I, no, the, I don't smoke. I don't drink. And I am going to. Where did you get from? I am from. I go to bed early. Simple. I go to bed early. Okay. So I am doesn't come here. I go to bed early. You Here you add don't to make negative. Here to make positive, you, you don't use the don't. That's all. So I go to bed early. You use subject, verb, followed by object. That's simple. Okay. okay so let's, yeah. So I, I, I like can't try, try again. again. Yes, please try. Yeah. I don't smoke. I don't drink. Mm -hmm. And and I and I and I I go. To bed early. No. Yeah, that's fine. I go to bed early. Wonderful. 
Okay. N next one. Okay. Number eight. So I think I, I think I think it would be uh is the is the, yeah yeah is the negative why it is in okay. okay number eight he doesn't okay. smoke number number eight he doesn't smoke he doesn't drink uh -huh. and he goes to bed early make this one opposite okay okay He doesn't smoke, he doesn't drink, and he goes to bed early. Sir, so somewhat disturb me. Wait, call. Can you sign in the mobile phone for now, please, until you finish the class? Yeah. yeah. Okay. No, no, I should, I should, I should continue. Uh, I'm free now. Okay, good. Uh, number eight. Try number eight. He doesn't smoke, he doesn't drink, okay. and he goes to bed early. Okay. The second. Okay, he he is smoke. Mm -hmm. He is smoke. He is drink and. He doesn't, and he's that he doesn't go to bed early. Beautiful, except there is something missing. He smokes, you know, he smokes. It is a present simple third person singular number he, and when it is third person singular yeah, number yeah. with the verb, we have to use s. He s, smokes. S, yeah. He smokes, yeah. he drinks, and he doesn't go to bed early. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Number four, write two false sentences about yourself. Ask the class to correct them. I like playing football. You don't like football. You hate it. Erica goes to university. She doesn't go to university. She works in a bank. So if I say, I like playing football. So to, you know, write two false sentences about yourself. Ask the class correct uh, class to correct them. So any two false sentences, like you can say, I don't learn English. You know, you're learning English. Well, you learn English like this. Okay, anyway, we'll go past this one because we need more people to type this one. So we'll go to the next page. All right, now we are going to uh, work on this one, vocabulary and listening. How do you relax? Answer the questions. What season is it now? What are the other seasons? What month is it now? Say all the months. Which months are the different season? Can you tell something about this one? If you can answer the question, what season is it now? Okay, okay. Uh, now is a uh, Armatan season. Autumn, you mean autumn season? How many seasons do you have in Ghana? You, sorry, you're, you're, Ga which, you're from Ghana, in right? Ghana, yeah, we are. In Ghana, we, in Ghana, we have two seasons. 
two season what we are have, the season yeah we have the amatan and the uh, musin the musin now is tam uh, for musin the musin amatan what? is yeah are you using your language um what does it say in english is it summer winter autumn spring which one the term uh the term uh, the term is raining okay is it, is, is, is it is it hot or cold now there no cold cold so it's winter season right so you have winter and summer is, is that you want to say maybe you have a two season in ghana winter and summer yeah. Okay, so it's uh, winter, winter now. Summer. Okay, yeah. what season it is now? It is winter season. So it is yeah. winter season now. Yeah. What are the other seasons? You have a summer. Good. What month is it now? What month is it now? Uh, ma there is no June. 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 Say all the months, yeah. please. Can you say all the months from January? January is Sif. January. February, March, March, May, April, June, April, April May. Yeah, April, April, May, June. Okay. May, June, July. Yeah. yeah. July. July. August. August. September. 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 October. October. Yeah. November. November. December. Yeah. Good. December. Which months yeah. are the different season? Can you say that one? As you said, you have a two season anyway winter and yeah. summer so maybe yeah. in a half up okay when did your uh, winter season started was that last few months ago or now is it about to finish or just started the season winter yeah the the season starting uh may oh, okay in it Ghana started here. in may okay uh, no problem Ghana. good well done Next one, look at uh, photos A to P, match the words and photos. Which activities usually go with one season, which go with more season? So now uh, we'll see, uh, these are the activities we can see, like playing golf, playing cinema, playing tennis, swimming, windsurfing, going to the gym, playing a musical instrument, watching TV, playing computers game listening to music dancing running fishing skying cycling cooking likewise we do have some photos with a uh, to p from here we have to match which activities goes where can you do this one a little bit zoom out so you can understand better now see we have one here which one goes where Okay. Let's just start with A or you know playing A. golf. A. Playing golf. Where is golf? Uh, going to cinema. So like F is going to cinema, right? They're having popcorn, watching cinema. So going to cinema is F. Good. Number playing tennis. Tennis. Which one playing tennis? Tennis. Tennis, tennis, tennis. I think we these, these guys are playing tennis, right? So it's an H. Yeah, yeah, H. H. Playing golf. Who is playing golf here? Try, try fast. It's very simple. Playing golf. golf. Who is playing golf? See the photos. Yeah, yeah, P. Number P. Number P is playing golf. Good. And the next one, swimming. Who's doing swimming? Swimming number C. Number C, swimming. Good. Windsurfing, windsurfing. Which one is windsurfing? Windsurfing. Oh, where do I see? Windsurfing. This is windsurfing, I think, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, N. A. A is it windsurfing. Okay. Number uh going to the gym. Going to the gym. 
Something going to the gym. Mm. Number M. Hmm? M? M, yeah. Okay, yeah, that's right. Going to the gym is M. Now, beautiful. Playing a musical instrument. Music. Playing a musical instrument. Number E. This one. Watching yeah, number TV. E. Watching TV. Who is watching TV? Watching TV. Watching watching TV. Number D. Number D. That's right. Ah, carry on. Next, next, carry on. Okay, playing computer. Uh, yeah, number K. Number K. Yeah. Number K playing computer games. Yeah, and, okay, and you're listening, listening to music. To music. Listen to music number I. Number I. Dancing. 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 Dancing number G. Number G is dancing. Good. And running. running. What will be the running? Running. Yeah, to cross the addition. The number G. Number J. This is the running. Number J. 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 Was, J. Yeah, J. No? Okay. Yeah, J. It. Fishing. Which one the fishing this is? This is number N. N. Number N is fishing. Skying. Which one the sky? The sky. View the sky. Skying. Which one is sky? sky? Huh? Number C. Oh, L, L, this one is sky, sky, you see, this is called sky, cycling, number L, B. L, cycling, number B, cooking, what, which one is cooking here, cooking, yeah, uh, L, number cycling, cooking Cycling. is O, this one, right? Oh. Oh. This one cooking, right? She's cooking. Anyway, that was wonderful. Now I would like to ask you some question, like playing golf, which season the golf is playable, do you think? You, um, if you have to play golf, which season would you play golf? In winter you will play or in the, summer? The summer. In summer or winter? Maybe you can play in summer. Season. In summer. In yeah? summer, yeah. Okay. I would I would prefer in winter though. Okay. So when we are done to learn, well, you can send me summer and uh, you write and then send to me. Beg your pardon? I didn't get you. Would you mind repeating for yourself again, please? I said that uh, when you done to learn. You can write summer and uh, another season you can send to me. Okay, no problem. I'll send you summer and winter. Okay, okay no yeah, problem. Summer, yeah. Now, okay, let's do this one. Why the page, page view, one page. Okay, good. Hmm. We have done this. Now we are going to this part. This part, okay. What do the people like doing in their free time? When? So we are going to listen this audio and then we have to answer. These are the people, Anna, Roja, Linda, Adam and Josh, Sue and Bob. So what do the people like doing in their free time? So we are going to listen what they do in their free time and okay. when they do that, okay? So listen carefully, okay. we have to answer this. So looking for the things they do in their free time and the time when they do. Okay, let's listen. 3.6. What we do in our free time. 1. Anna. I play tennis a lot, 
I'm no good, but I like playing. When do you play? Oh, in summer I play every weekend. Just in summer? No, sometimes in spring and autumn too, if it's sunny. Good. So what will be this one? The Anna? first, uh, she, she plays tennis. Tennis? And when does she play? Summer. And what other season she plays? She plays tennis in summer. Summer, autumn, sometime in spring, more than one season, she can play. Okay, good. Next one, okay. Roger. Two. Roger. My favorite sport is skiing. I go skiing with my family every year. We all love it. When do you go? Always in January or February, after Christmas. We go to France. And are you a good skier? I'm OK. My wife's good. The kids are really good, but I'm just OK. Number two, Rosa. OK, Rosa likes skiing. Skiing. And she, when, uh, when does he do that? January and February. January and February. OK, great. Right. Mm. Next one. Three. Linda. Do you go to the gym every day? Yes, I do. Every day. Every morning before work. And do you go swimming there? Yes, I swim every morning too. Do you go to the gym? Well, uh, no, I don't. I like my bed in the morning. Linda, what she does? Uh, she... She go swimming and uh, she I uh, she does swimming I forget the, uh -huh. and she does every day right yeah okay good next one four Adam and Adam and Josh Adam you like a lot of sports don't you oh yeah my favorite is windsurfing me and my brother Josh go to surf school every summer, and we play golf and football, of course. So, all outdoor sports? Uh, no. We watch sport a lot on TV, and we play computer games after school. Not a lot of time for homework, then. Well, uh, I tend to do... So, what Adam and Joseph... Five. Okay. Sue and Bob. Adam and Josh... Uh... His favorite things, uh, they like sports. They do windsurfing, okay, and also they yeah. like football, and they do it yeah. after the school. Okay, good. Mm. Sue and Bob, listen to Bob. Sue and Bob. Sue, what do you and Bob do in your free time? Well, in winter, we love evenings at home. What do you do? Watch TV? Yes, we do sometimes. We like cookery programs. I love cooking. I like cooking too. <laughs> but you know our family. We love our music. I often just sit down at the piano and play. And our son plays the guitar. That's great. You're a really musical family. Okay, so number five, Sue and Bob. They like playing guitar. They yeah, like cooking. Yeah. In the yeah. evening, they do usually. Okay, great. Yeah. So, we love playing guitar also. Mm, in the grammar sport, we, as I have told you earlier, that like plus ing, when you say <laughs> verb like, mm -hmm. and you know, after that, usually there'll be ing, like I like playing golf, I don't mm -hmm. like running. Okay, so we have learned yeah. in our grammar like plus ing verb. Okay, yeah. remember, yeah. That. Number four, discuss in a group that what you think your teacher like likes doing i think he she likes going to the cinema no i think he she prefers watching tv okay, let it go this one talking about you tell the other student what you like doing and what you don't like doing ask question about the activities don't watch tv much but i like playing computer games or really what okay now tell me um about yourself, what do you like and what you don't like doing things in your free time? 
I want to know from you. Can you try? Yeah. Okay. In my free time, mm -hmm. in my free time, I like in, I like to walk, I like to watch TV. Yep. You, you like watching TV. Remember, after yeah, the light, I like, you have to use ING yeah, verb. Yeah, I, yeah, I like watching TV. Mm -hmm. I like watching TV and uh, I hear uh, the news, the news. Okay, so you like watching TV and mm -hmm. you watch uh, news on the TV. Okay, good. That comes yeah. all under uh, yeah, like some watching time. TV. Sometimes uh, I read my English book. Sometimes you like reading English book. Okay, yeah, sometimes, sometimes I like reading English book. Okay. okay. Sometimes I like reading English book. Good. Okay. What else? Mm. I think it's that's all. And what you don't like? Okay. Uh, I don't like music. You don't like listening to music? I I, I don't like listening to music. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm, I don't like playing football. Don't like playing football. Okay, great. So you see yeah. the use of like plus ing. I like doing this. I don't like doing that. Okay, like this. Great. Mm -hmm. Next one. Reading and speaking. Busy weekends. Reading and speaking. We'll do this one in another day. But today we'll do some more practice maybe here. Okay, let's see. Now, I want you to read this one and tell me which one in which sentence, which tense. Okay, from here. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What time do you get up? You get up. What time do you get up? Which dance it is in? What time do you get up? Which dance it is in? So what time do you get up? It is in present simple in an interrogative or question form, right? So we make question. Thank you. Uh, please for, for, forgive me. I was uh, miss something. So okay. what what time do you get up? Yep. Which it's, time? Uh, what time do you get up? Hmm. It's the present simple. Present simple and in? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the negative 
answer and negative question in interrogative or questions yeah. from interrogative or yeah. questions from okay interrogative okay. interrogative or questions from questions then from. yeah hmm. yeah yep. then Next one. who do you live with hmm. also present simple interrogative Conscience. Good. Next one. How do you travel to school? Mm -hmm. Present simple. Uh, interrogative question. Good. Do you go out on Fridays? Present simple. What do you do on Sundays? Present simple, interrogative. Where do you go on Friday? Where do you go on Friday? Is the present simple, interrogative. First plural. Why do you like to go there? Why do you like to go there? Present. Present simple. Good. And Then when do you go to bed to bed? Present and present tense. Mm -hmm. Interrogative. Yeah. I think that is all present tense. Oh. Okay. Beautiful. So here, I want you to do some identification here. As much as you know, read each sentence. Tell me which tense it is, what grammar involved here. I want to know something from you. Carry on. Number three. Are you there, Mohammed? Hello. All right, I think there is a technical problem and Mohammed went off. And also we're about to finish the class. See if he can join again, otherwise we'll finish the class for today. All right, uh, that's all pretty much for the today. Uh, thank you very much for joining, guys. We'll see you tomorrow, nine o'clock sharp um, in Bangladesh time. And tomorrow we're going to have intermediate English language course. Those who would like to join, most welcome to join for tomorrow at 9 p.m. Thank you very much. You have a wonderful night. Bye for now.